Hey y'all, uh, this is just a quick follow up uh, for the uh, command line YouTube downloader and it, it does in fact work in Windows. So we'll go to this site and uh, I don't have my zoom tool in. Yeah, it's rg3.github.com slash YouTube dash DL. And the main thing it says here is you need a uh, Python interpreter Python interpreter and that's what you do is you just click that link and let me just uh, you go to the right side left side sorry I go to download scroll down and Python for Windows if you have a 32-bit system get this first one if you're running 64 you get this one and download it okay and go back up to now it says download it here and we go to where it's you go to where it says this link here which is uh 2012 02 27 so february 27th of this year uh yeah i'll zoom out um at first you'll be going huh <laughs> what's this all it is is a, a python file which is fairly, like I mean, the it's fairly simple to deal with. Okay, so you press Control A and then press Control C. Okay, we'll minimize this. And you, I I use Notepad plus plus. You can try Notepad, but plus plus is a little more. Uh, it'll format it better for you. I find. And you just do uh, file save as. Now let's go to the desktop and under here under file type say all the way up all files okay and we'll call it uh, something yt dash d l dot p y save we'll close this out and we don't need this. And now you go to the where you download your Python interpreter. You run. Install for all users. It will install on Python. It says 2.7 on the C drive. You can change it if you wish. Next. That's fine. Select the command prompt. And finish. And voila, it now is a py file, which is a Python file. So let's go back to the weeb. Uh, I'll open the uh, YouTube. Oh, I gotta sign in. Oops, wrong site. Wrong button, I mean. Okay. I'll go to my videos, video manager. And the last one I did was on the Linux, so we'll go to this. Pause. Pause that. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, as I mentioned before, best way is to select share and just copy this. And just open, uh, go to CMD. Okay. Uh, let's change directory to, I don't know if you can change directory to desktop or not from here. Yes, you can. Okay. You just take this Python script that we have, and you just drag it in there. And then you press space, and then you just paste in the uh, URL, the link. Can I explain this? No, it won't let me. Uh, that I had, and then just press enter. Setting up language, and it starts downloading. And you can see on the desktop here, it's an MP4. It's in parts right now. But it's going to take uh, about a minute or so to download. So I'll just pause this for a sec and wait for it to finish downloading. Okay, we're almost finished. Just wanted to show you if you look at this file, once it's finished downloading, Boom! It changes to an MP4. 
So you can close this. And you can open it with, uh, say, VLC. And if... Mute the volume for a sec. And Kodak information. Whoops. Sorry about that. Try to move this some more. 1920 by 1080. And there it is there. And it's pretty simple. Minimize, and this file size, I think, uh, well, I'll find out right now, is 60 megabytes. 60, 60 .1 megabytes. Downloaded. That's the 1920 by 1080 file, obviously. We'll go to full screen. Okay, so that, that's it. That's all you got to do. Any questions or comments or whatever, uh, feel free to add them, and I'll put the links in the description. And that's all. Okay, so thanks so much for watching, and uh, bye for now.